Hello everyone. In this particular video, I am going to talk about a mind trick which can make you all happy because 2014 is approaching and I thought it's better I let you all know this trick so that you can also follow and try to be happy each and every moment of your life. Happiness is a state of mind and we think that we are getting happiness by buying a particular thing or going to a particular place etc. But happiness is within us. A lot of Indian sages, a lot of philosophers have already explained this that happiness is within you. But Till now, we are struggling to understand it. So I thought, through this video, I will explain a simple trick so that you can always be happy if you follow that sincerely. And one more thing, happiness, if we are not happy, it's not just we are not happy. People around us is also not happy. Agree. Isn't it? We affect our parents, we affect our friends, relatives. Everyone is sad. They don't want to see you sad. Everyone wanted to see you, look at you with a happy smile in your face. So, how to find the hidden happiness within us? Here is the trick. But before I go to the trick, let me all make you all happy. Just think about any incident which happened in your life which made you happy. Everyone would have come across a lot of happiness in their life in the past, right? Just now think about some moments in your life which made you happy. It could be either a uh, recognition you got or it could be you have done a great achievement even if others never recognize you felt that happiness within you or it could be the first time you fell in love with someone just think about those thoughts see the thoughts not just it comes it comes along with the memories the exact place, the exact time, people, you are actually seeing that now, right now. But you travel back in time, but the memories are still there. And you are feeling the same happiness what you felt that time. Yes or no? Yes. So, the happiness which was hidden there, you have triggered that via a thought. So if your thought is healthy, if your thought is looking for only happy moments in your life, you are always happy. And the other way around as well, if something was happened in your life or you felt ashamed or you are feeling fear of something, someone. If you think of those thoughts, you are definitely going to be sad. Those memories is going to come and it's going to definitely affect you. So the trick here is when we are very sad, just go back, drill down and get the thoughts which made you happy. This is called balancing act, actually. Bhagavan Krishna says in Bhagavad Gita, the mind should be balanced. So when you are sad, start thinking about happy moments in your life. When you are happy, still try to maintain that happiness. That's enough. I'm not going to say, think of the bad things. So you're going to affect uh, your family, friends, everyone. And the other, other thing is, we have to be true to our conscience. We need to, to tell the truth. 
at least 90 percent try to be honest and tell the truth i have undergone these situations in my life and that's why i'm telling i know even my own parents look when i i can i don't have the guts that time to look at them face to face because i was not honest i was telling a lot of lies so i had the fear to even look at my own parents until the fear that you tell the truth you can't face the world you can't face your own family people they look like you they for you they will look like my God, when they are going to catch hold of me because I am lying. That fear will always be there. There is no healthy family relationship there. So, I would suggest everyone, at least 90% try to tell the truth. Try your level best to be honest. If you follow these two traits, your life is going to be really happy. I assure you. And the other thing is, God, when He wants to give something, He gives only what we prefer, what we love. If our thoughts are always thinking about good things, He is going to definitely give you good. If we are thinking about only bad things and lot of other nonsense, then we are going to get back that nonsense. We can't blame God for that. It is our own thought process. If you like how food is food is required to keep the body healthy, same way good thoughts are required to keep your mind healthy. Remember this. So try to be honest and always try to fine-tune your brain so that you are always in the happy state. Keep following this trick and try to find the hidden happiness within you and wish you all a very happy new year. Please take care.